this video, I'm gonna find a winning product, build a ClickFunnels website, and start running ads to it and show you guys the results. Hey guys, my name is Sagar. In this video, I'll be going from A to Z. How do I find winning products? How to build a funnel? And we'll be running ads live and show you guys how much profit we made. I made $400 off each of these talents. Or how much money we lost. Basically, I'll be covering everything you need to know about dropshipping. So watch the whole video if you want to start dropshipping and wants to start making money online. But for all the guys who doesn't know what ClickFunnels is, it's basically a different version of Shopify, which is a little bit more advanced, a little bit more complex, but I've been hearing a lot online that, oh, it's the way to go, blah, 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 blah. So I wanted to give it a shot, see how it does. And I wanted to sh show you guys the results. Is it worth it or is it not? So with that being said, let's get to the first point, which is product research. So for product research, my favorite tool right now is DrawPoint. Right now, as of May 9th, 10th, whatever it is, it's my favorite tool to go to because it's super easy and it's only $5, you know? So you just log on to DrawPoint, you know, I'll actually leave the link below. So this is how it kind of works. So you go to live advertisement filter or winning advertisement filter, they're pretty much the same. And you scroll, 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 and you keep scrolling till you find good products that you're interested in, you know? So as we know, it's kind of corner of this season. So we're gonna try to find products that actually you will make way more sense. So I think this is a really good one because people can go outside and get their eyebrows done. Same with I saw some eyebrow stuff. So that's what I did. You know, I went scrolly, 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 and I scrolled everything. You know, so the first product I came with hair clippers. I was like, dope. That's a fire product. But then I ran into this issue. I went on AliExpress, so I couldn't find any value supplier that can give me four to seven day shipping or faster shipping at all. So we had to throw the product away and I went back on drop point and I did the again scrolly scrolly thing and I found this product which I'm going to show you the ad right now which is called poly gel. So basically it's a nail paint and you can basically do your nails at home. You don't have to go to a saloon. Pretty much self-explanatory you know it's just nail paint you know so about three weeks ago and 4.4 million views I was like whoa that's dope you know and then I found different different uh, page but running the same product is basically the same nail gel thing you know and I was like dope that's crazy and this one have even crazier engagement in three weeks 6.5 million views look at the engagement 13k comment when I saw that I was like this is the product we're gonna go with because even this one has 3.2k comments this one, 13.8, 13,000 comment, I was already sold. So this was the product we're gonna go with. But the next step was, can we find this product on AliExpress? But before that, I wanna let you know for drop one, I'll actually leave a affiliate link in the link below. You guys can sign up. It's only $5. I think it's super worth it. And you can cancel it anytime. You know, you can always find live ads that people are actually running. So right here, you can see so many cool ads. So I would definitely want you guys give it a go, you know, give it a go, see if you guys like it. And then I went on AliExpress, you know, I do what I do and I search poly gel nail kit. So I searched poly gel nail kit and I couldn't find any good suppliers and I ran the same issue. So what I did was I was like shipped from United States because I want fast shipping. And then I literally went through all the links. I'm literally saying I went to like 30, 40 links, every single link I checked, checked, checked. And finally, I found something that I, I was sold on right away. And this was the product right here. And this one doesn't have much reviews, but it does have 125 artists. So I was like, that's enough. You know, if people were mad, they would have already given bad reviews. So pretty good. And you can see United States ship within four to, four to 13 days, which is perfect. And this product is gonna cost us about $16, right? So I was like, that's sold, you know? So they were selling the whole package for around $36.99. So I was like, I'm gonna just sell for $39.99 because I know that whenever girls gets their nail done, it costs them about $30, $40. I might be wrong, but I think I remember someone told me that it cost $34. So I was like, I'm gonna just charge them $39.99, which sounds perfect. And it has fast shipping. So I was like, boom, deal done. So I was sold on this product and this was the product I was gonna go with. So the product is finalized, you know, we got the product and we got the supplier. For your case, you know, what I would recommend you make sure DM the suppliers, make sure they have a product and they can ship fast. You know, usually they do, but just want to confirm it. And the next step is website creation. So for website creation, as you guys know, we are using ClickFunnels. 
by my boy Russell Brunson. Shout out to Russell Brunson. So basically, ClickFunnels is like a, a Shopify, but it's uh, pages, you know, rather than having a whole website, you get pages. So ClickFunnels is definitely probably a new concept for some of you guys. Some of you guys already know it. So I'm gonna try my best to explain it. Like anything else in the world, you don't know what you don't know, but this video will actually help you to understand, put some concepts together, and you can probably see it's not that hard. Just like anything, if you do it multiple times, you become a pro, you know? So the first thing first, you sign up for ClickFunnels and you wanna click on Funnels. So right here, you click on Funnels and you will land that looks something like this, you know? And then you click on Add New. You probably wouldn't have all these pages. You click on Add New and you go to Start Cookbook. And from Cookbook, you just click on E-commerce right here. It will basically pop up all the e-commerce funnels that are doing good in the industry. So what we're gonna use is two-step tripwire funnel. It's basically, I'll show you what it is, but I go with two-step tripwire. It comes with a two-step uh, order form right here. And you can choose any of this, you know. You choose the free ones, you know, whatever you wanna do. Go with this one, it's pretty good. But as like I say, you guys are watching the video, I wanted to make it easy for you. I'm actually gonna share my funnel, basically my website with you guys that your plug and play is literally gonna be plug and play. So keep watching the video if you want that. So next thing you have that thing right here and you click on it, it will look something like this and the page would be right here, right? And then what you wanna do is just click edit page, you know? So I'm gonna open this in a new tab and I'm gonna click edit page. So when you edit page, you can actually control all aspects of the page. And you will land on something that looks like this. Looks pretty, I know, probably looks super, super scary to you, but believe me, like anything, if you do it over and over, you'll become a pro and people will ask you for help. First things first, we need a logo and a name. So I did some research and I heard a lot of beauty brands have like a name in there. There's like a really big brand. It's called Anastasia Beverly Hills. And there's like super name ones where it's a name and then it's the product thing. So I just came up with this name called Eva and I just made it a cosmetics and I, I was able to get the domain which is called Eva Cosmetics, you know. So the next thing was making logo. Like I said, I don't like to spend money. So I went on my favorite Canva.com, which was pretty simple. I went to Canva.com and I went to text and right here, this is the exact text I use. I draw, drag and drop and I increase the size and I change this to cosmetics, boom. And then I write this thing, I change with by Eva. And boom, we had a beautiful logo and I saved it and boom, I throw it right here. It's pretty easy in ClickFunnels. You can literally click right here. So I'll show you a little bit more. You can literally paste the link right here and it will pop up, but just don't worry about that. We'll get into it. So this is how kind of the website looks like. There's a picture. Let me show you how it looks in the mobile format because that's all that matters. So there's our logo, there's the name, there's our picture and it will say the price. A little urgency right here, only eight left at this price. By now, probably looks a lot scammy to you, but that's how kind of the websites look like. For all the people who watch this far, this is what I'm gonna do for you. So you guys see this whole page, just so you don't have to recreate the whole thing if you wanna sell this exact product. I'll leave a link below where you can get the funnel and you can get a 14 day free trial for click funnels. So you get 14 day free and you will already have this funnel like this website on your thing. So you can literally do plug and play or let's say you wanna sell a different product, you can literally change it right here. You wanna sell a train, uh, I don't know, you wanna sell a water bottle, you just change this with water bottle, change the picture with water bottle, just plug and play basically. So that's what I wanna do for you. So just go in the description and it will say click funnels link and just click on that and you will get a free link and you'll get the free funnels. All right, so let's just not waste any more time. There's a buy now button and there's some text, some more about the product, more about the product and there's a GIF and boom, there's this thing. And this is the best thing about ClickFunnels. This is where ClickFunnels get really, really, really exciting. You know how your Shopify website, people click on add to cart and people click on initial check on people, all the stuff, but here, it doesn't work like that. The checkout is on the same page. People buy on the same page. So people can enter their stuff right here, all that stuff. And once they click, yes, I want this, it looks something like this. They put their credit card number, CVZ, boom, and everything is done. We'll go through this process too. So let me just teach you a little bit about ClickFunnels. So you see this? Basically everything you see on ClickFunnels is literally a section. So let me show you what a section is, right? You see this section right here? If it's blank page, let's imagine this is a blank page. All you do is you click add section and it will ask you, what you do full width, and you just drop it right here and boom now we have a section you see this this is a section inside the section there goes rows add a new row 
careful. This is the most important part about ClickFunnels I'm talking about. So you just select any of this. Most of the time, this gets the job done two by two column. Basically what it is, two boxes. We'll split one box into two. So there's a section and there's rows. You can have multiple rows. You can add another row, which is gonna be one by one. You can add another row, which is gonna be six by six, which is gonna look stupid. You guys get the point, right? But we usually go with two by two. In every single row, everything you are seeing is basically an element. So let me show you. So you click on add new element and you type text. Uh, let's type headline. So there's the headline text right here. You just drag, drag and drop right here, boom. And right here, you add a picture uh, image. You see, that's all ClickFunnels is, picture and text. And you can do multiple layers. You can add another headline right here. You can add another headline right here. And then you can control the size. You can click this and you can click on settings and you can make this small. And that's how this whole entire page is built on. So let me show you. So this is two sections. This links doesn't work. They just appear on there. This is one section, which is just text. This is another picture, text, text. This is another special feature in ClickFunnels. It's called uh, urgency. So you can literally click on here and scroll all the way down. It's called progress bar. You click on here and that's what the progress bar is. You can literally change it and I'm gonna change it to animated stripes and I'm gonna change it to 90% done and I can change it to any color. See, that's all of what's going on right here. And I change the text. And then another thing you guys do is we add a buy now button, which is kind of nothing. So this is a button right here. Basically what, and whenever someone clicks on this button, all it's doing is it scrolls them right here. The buy now button is literally like a button. It's not doing anything, you know? Uh, right now I tell my buttons, whenever someone click on here, it just scrolls. You guys can see right here, scroll. It basically scrolls them right here to my checkout process. Right here, same thing, same thing, same thing. A lot of you guys are probably wondering how to get this green thing. Simple, you click add new row, right? You get a new row, two by two or whatever you want, right? You get a two by two and then you click settings. And then right here, background color, let's say you want yellow. And that's it, it's yellow. Let's say you want blue, it's blue. Whatever color you want, it will be that color and you just make it bigger, you know? So that's what's going on. This two-step checkout form, how do you get this? Simple. You click add new element and it's right here, two-step order form. I wouldn't click it cause it will fuck up the whole thing cause you are not supposed to have two checkouts on one page cause it will of course trip the algorithm. Another thing I like to change my add to cart buttons, I always tell them, yes, I want my product or whatever the product name is. Again, headline, picture, and this is just font. So another thing, this is bullet points. You can get this, there's an element for it. You click add new element and it's right here, bullet list. Boom, the bullet list popped up. Super simple, this is again, we got the color in the background, we got the buy now button and the text. Text, 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 picture, I'm using a GIF. Again, text, picture, picture. Uh, this is again, text and picture, and this is just reviews, you know? And I always like to do detailed reviews, big ass reviews, because if someone reviews, I want it to make an effect. Great, picture. This is logos, it's super easy to get logos. So all you do is basically click new element, and then if you scroll down, there's, oh, actually you can just get headline. So all you do is click headline and then you raise the headline. We don't really care about that. You go to settings, you go to advanced and there's gonna be a thing called icon picker and you can pick any icon you want. Let's pick this one. Boom, the icon popped up. All you now do is go to settings and increase the size, boom. And you can change the color right here. Boom, that's all it is. So that's what I'm doing right here. Kind of makes it look professional in my eyes at least. Uh, yeah, we are doing 4 10 day delivery. Again, strip and there's people who of course have questions. I just let them know right here. Everything question is done, 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 done. Everything's pretty much done. Of course, you want to make sure you have these things. Uh, refund policy terms, service, they actually work. So if someone clicks them, they take them on a new page. How do you do that? Super simple. There's literally a section in there you click right here, you click add new element and there's a section called, it's called navigation right here. And boom, you see how this thing, th three things popped up. That's how you almost edit everything. You click on settings and I'm pretty sure it's right here, font size, you just increase the font size, boom. And there you have it guys. You have, you build a whole click function within a few seconds. All you have to do is play around with it and it should be good to go. And uh, I already added pixel. How do you add pixels? Super easy, you know, you go to tracking code 
and you paste the whole Facebook pixel script right here. How do you get this script? Super easy. In the pixel section, I'm not gonna go deep because you can go on YouTube and search everything you need to know about it. But all you do is you go on YouTube and you go to my channel and you smash the like button right, right, right now. No, I'm just kidding. All you have to do is you can search other people's video on YouTube or you can go to Facebook and when you know how you select add shopping integration after pixel you just do manually add the pixel and they'll give you a little uh, code and you just add that tracking code right here you drop it right here you know it's a little process but you should be able to figure it out you're a smart person i can attest for that all right so everything is good to go so this is how it's going to look on phone and just to show you i already bought the domain so you can just go on avacosmetics.com and boom it will pop up mm, right here right here looks beautiful so this is what i was talking about whenever someone clicks on buy now it just scrolls them right here. So let's say someone clicks buy now right here, it will scroll them up. That's all it's doing. You don't have to put this uh, checkout thing, but you can, it's kind of your choice. You know, it's gonna be included in the funnel. So all you have to do is click in the description and you get this whole page and you can edit it yourself, which makes the whole process 10 times more easier. We'll actually complete the checkout in a minute, but let's leave it alone. This is how the check is gonna look like. Picture, uh, 30 day money back guarantee. This is just for people giving them more to buy you know people don't feel scared you know if they know they got money back guarantee they are more likely to buy and you just tell them how to use the product of course it's going to be different for every single product but i just show them how they can use the product again telling them buy the product save money uh, more about the product some gifts some pictures what's in the box there's a lot of stuff that comes in the box so i let them know multiple mail paints and all that good stuff i uh, hear a uh, reviews if someone scrolled this far i'm pretty sure they're pretty much likely interested in the product so now you want to sell them through reviews and like detailed reviews really big reviews some random logos uh, from our customers pretty much you guys can check out and read the whole thing see just to prove that these are working i just click on terms of service and boom this is going on a new page which is pretty easy to do so now this is how the checkout process work you enter all the information you enter everything boom 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 boom, boom select the country and it states and you click yes i want my poly gel nail kit and people click that and then they pops up right here this is a special thing so you see how this product is going was going to sell about 40 dollars but what we do with click funnels this is where the magic starts with click funnels so we sell them one we tell them hey buy two that's a popular gift deal this is the exact text works great for me popular gift deal and this what I, what you are seeing how they have three things it doesn't come with click funnel so if you download this funnel you'll get this so you will be able to adjust it just like this how i have it so i kind of code i put a little bit of code in it don't worry guys once you sign up the link i have i'll actually you can reach out to me through email and i can send you the video which will explain how the code is working super simple it takes about a 10 minute video which will you will be a pro how exactly the code is working and then people can select this but the magic is it's pre-selected right here 74.99 and then people add their credit card number makes the whole process easier and boom click shipping insurance what is shipping insurance it's basically nothing so all it is is telling them basically shipping insurance explain itself that if you buy the product it get lost in the mail anything happens we'll cover it but i'm gonna cover it anyway so it doesn't matter you know so i'm gonna use shipping insurance so and the people like ship my order now and boom the order is done so that's how the whole funnel works it's pretty quick you guys see people come here um if they want to buy the product right away boom they can buy it click it right here and uh, we're gonna take their money and i'm gonna give them the product this is where not the magic is not done yet that's why click funnels has a special place in my heart not up there with shopify but it does have a special place so this is another thing click funnel does really good so i'm gonna go back right so what it does is so you guys see this is our page so but whenever someone buys our product there's this special thing happens it doesn't send them to the thank you page it sends them to this page hey your order is not yet complete you will only see this page once one time offer only buy this thing for 29.97 and boom if they want to buy it all they have to click this button and it will automatically charge their card. They don't have to put their credit card again. That's the really good thing about ClickFunnels. There's not other platforms that can do this for you, but ClickFunnels can. And boom, this is done right here. And pretty much that's how it works. You know, people click, if they click no thanks, I don't want to save money. I don't want to buy your product. This is what it does. Boom, they click it and it sends them to another funnel. Be like, yo, 
30% off rather than buying for $29, let's buy for $19. And someone can buy it. If they say, no, thanks, I don't want my product, it just sends them to thank you page. Boom. Once they say no twice, they send them to praise. But if they decide to buy it, we will send them to another page, which is a second upsell, which looks something like this, which is like a hair dryer. This uh, pretty much reviews and everything. And this is how my order confirmation looks like. It's my picture, like cute face right here. Sagar Miller, like I said, if you don't want to put your face, just put a random face. But like I said, if you can't even put your face on the brand, I feel like you shouldn't be drop shipping it because you are full of shit. Most people don't want to put their face because they are scared that people are going to recognize them. But provide a great experience to the customer. You'll never have any complaints, you know. And I'll let them know this is my email address. Hit me up and I'll make sure your product gets shipped and everything. Boom, 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 boom. Frequently answered question answered again just in case they have any question and 30 day money back guarantee. You just let them know. Any question will refund you. Refunds are better than chargeback. Remember that. And that's how it kind of works. You know, click from this page is done. I can talk about it for two hours, like I said, but I want you to do the honor, sir. I want you to actually sign up for it, make a page, and I can on my side see that you have a ClickFunnels account. Then send me an email and I'll send you the video I have where I'm going a little bit more, explaining more about ClickFunnels, or I can just answer your uh, questions in general. You know, so reach out to me through email or DMs and let me know all about the ClickFunnels through your link, but I can't figure out this, so I'll let you, I'll guide you in the right direction. So ClickFunnels part is done. Now the part is, ad creation so for ad creation i decided to go my dear friend bands of ads so i went on bands of ads signed up and i went to video ads oh she kind of bad but that's not the point right here you go to three and five day delivery and you just add to cart and that's what i got you know i got the one day delivery because of course i have special connects you know but no shout out to my boy he actually gave me a free thing one day delivery so he waived the hundred dollar fees for me because he was like i'll get it done for you he just wanted me to tell you guys, go out there. If you want a video done, three to five day delivery right here. And I said, negotiated for you guys. So it's $57. I thought that's not fair. So I got a special code called Saga 20. So if you use Saga 20 on bands of ads, you get $11, 40 cents off, which is 45. So I thought $45 is a fair price for a video in three to five days. So like I said, this is where I got the video done. And for the second video, like I said, I always recommend two or three videos. What I did was, Remember I showed you guys two ads right here. So basically I threw both these ads into Premiere Pro and I took 10 seconds from this ad and I took 10 seconds from this ad and I just literally put that snip in the middle of this ad. That's all I did. I basically mix and match, you know, 10 seconds, 10 seconds from this clip, throw in the middle, boom. And that's how I made it. So let me show you guys the ads. But like I said, if you want an ad done, Go to Bands of Ads, sign up. I'll leave a link below and use Saga 20. Make sure to use Saga 20 so you get your, you save your money and go with this one. Right now, they're not doing any more one-day delivery because it's just getting out of control. But like I said, if you really want one-day delivery, you can, of course, buy that for $10 million. It's right here. This is the one I made myself, so here we go. And I even throw the logo on there. What I did was I put the 10 second clip in the middle, put my logo on there and change the background music and boom, here's the video. And here is the thumbnail, you know, pretty simple. It's just nails with a big ass emoji and that's all for ads, you know. And after that, we got the ads done and boom, we were ready to, we are ready to go. And now launching ads. 
I know a lot of people are waiting for that, so let's just get to it. I don't want you guys to wait any longer. So this is how I try with the thing. So we hopped on to Business Manager. I made a new account just to do all these experiments on YouTube, just for you guys. First thing first, one campaign and 20 different ad sets. Like I said, I like to keep it really basic. There's thousand different ways you can test products, but believe me, they all do the same thing. What they're doing is they're taking the video you have and they try to throw in the Facebook algorithm and see if people are interested in the product. That's what all the testing method are doing, you know? So this is one of them. You can, of course, throw this, uh, change this campaign to a CBO campaign. If you are really have no idea what's going on, on the Facebook side of things, I have some good news for you. I have great, great, great videos on my channel about literally drop shipping Facebook ads and really detailed, really detailed video. So go ahead, you can go check them out. So this is what I did. I smashed the like button and make sure to hit the subscribe button right now. All right, so I decided 20 different, uh, you know, ad sets right here. And these are all exactly all the things I use, all the keywords, I mean, interest I use. And let's just go through the ad set. It's basically a purchase pixel right here, $5, started on the midnight. Only USA, why I'm doing only USA, usually I do worldwide excluding bad priority countries because whatever is going on right now, I don't know if I can provide worldwide fast shipping, but I know for US, I'm doing four to 13 days shipping. So I was like, let's just go to USA, open age, but I decided to go with women because of course the women product. What is Shellac, you ask me? I don't know. It just popped up. I clicked suggestion and it just popped up and I was like, all right, let's just go with this. I used to go with manual placement, but it's about to make that shift in my theory where I feel like automatic placements are actually kind of better than manual placements. One day click and everything looks great, you know, and that's what all the ad sets are. And then we went on to create an ad creative, you know, so let me show you all, both the ad creatives. So what I did was throw the video right here, put the text, you can also get beautiful links. Where do I get the text from? Literally from my competitors. I, sorry, I took your text, you know, I took my text from my competitors. And right here is the headline, um, website, put the website link right there. And same with second, I put throw the thumbnail right here. And this is the ad creative. I'm, I added myself ad creative too, remember that. For thumbnail, I just use a random picture. Uh, I have a cosmetics right here, sending them straight to the page. Same, pretty much same thing, a little bit different text using a lot of emojis. And that was pretty much it for Facebook ads. And we're gonna let them run. And I'll see you guys with the results. Move the money from your client's pocket into your pocket. All right, guys, your favorite Sagar Miller is back and it's time for results. And we made $269 so far. Hey, John, thank you for your vote of confidence. And welcome to the Investor Center. Yeah, thanks a lot. Bye-bye. Thanks. How'd you fucking do that? And we still have about 30 minutes to go for the day, but I'm pretty sure we're not gonna make more than that. But how much we did we really spend? And we spent about $100. So sounds pretty fair to me, you know? We made uh, $270 and we spent $100, but it gets really exciting when I'm gonna break down the stats, what's happening on the back end. So let's just go to the back end. I know a lot of people are seeing this $81. It's just me. I spent that $81 to see if everything was working on the back end yesterday. So that was working, but we actually made 269 from our customers. Another thing I wanna talk about is how it's saying website purchase conversion, $80. That's just another thing comes with ClickFunnels. Um, website purchase conversion is always fucked because people are buying more and less stuff and ClickFunnels is not able to properly track it, but it is what it is, you know? It is what it is. It is, it is what it is. <laughs> Can't really do much about it. So you just have to go based off your calculation. So let's just go here and go to our nail gel and we'll go through the sales, you know? So you'll be surprised what you will see, you know? So we only actually got three customers. We only had three people who bought stuff from us. This person, this person, and this person, but they spend way more money than they were supposed to. I mean, we did the upsell process and everything. So let me show you. If they buy the one, that's $40, but if they buy two, they get it for 75. If they buy three, $99. Look at this, guys. This guy bought two, this guy bought two. And the funny thing, almost all three of them bought a nail dryer. That's absolutely mind blowing to me that all these people always buy more stuff. So I did some basic math calculation, right? Let's say we spent $100 and I made an assumption. What if we wasn't using ClickFunnels? What if we were just using a Shopify website and we only got three sales of $40 each product? And I came with the assumption 
that would have landed us on about $25 negative because we would have still cost $48 for us to buy a product. So after doing all that math, we would be in about $25 negative. But with the click funnels, we actually end up making $70 profit. How? Because people bought more stuff and the average order value was around $80. And that's absolutely crazy. But I know a lot of people like, but ClickFunnels is $97. But guess what? ClickFunnels paid for $97 on the first day. Rather than being negative on 25, I'm $70 profit. So that's about $95. And I just made them the first day by only spending $100. Imagine how big of a difference it's gonna make over the lifetime and when I scale, if I decide to scale this product. Of course, I know I won't be able to scale this product right now because all of you guys are gonna go on my website and it's gonna fuck up the whole pixel. That's what I do for you guys. You know, I know you guys are gonna fuck the shit out of my pixel, but it's fine, you know? I made the video as a case study so you guys can learn. I'm not saying that it's gonna change the course of your entire business, but if you wanna give it a shot, I'll let you leave a ClickFunnels link below where you can get this whole funnel process free and it will be just as how it is structured. And if you wanna sell the same product, go for it. And if you wanna use the same ad sets right here, you can take a screenshot right here and take a screenshot right here. You can use this if you want, you know, but I, what I would recommend is try a different product, but use the same layer what I'm using and see how that goes for you. But I feel like the result is quite shocking. Rather than being in negative, we actually made $70 product and I'm super happy with that, you know? So with that being said, if you guys don't know what's going on, this is what's going on. So right here, you guys see $74.99. So look at this. So rather than buying the first one, a lot of people bought this thing right here. So that's why we made more money when we were supposed to. Only one customer bought the regular one. But the funny thing is this customer ended up buying the nail dryer for $30. So they still spend more, you know. So almost every single of the person went here and they bought the product. And then when we landed them on the new page, which is the dry lamp one, almost all three of bought it, which is absolutely shocking right here, you know. And this is what the upsell process is. Believe me, keep your upsell process simple as possible. Possible. That's what's worth, you know, that's what I was doing wrong the entire time because I used to use ClickFunnels like a year ago and I would make it super complex. Keep your upsell process super simple, just like this. And it works great, you know. So that's it for today's guys video. I try to keep it short, but I just can't resist and provide more, you know, and I wanted to explain more so you guys actually get it more. I do want to make entertaining video, but at the same time, I want to make sure you guys are learning something, you know. So smash the like button, subscribe, and leave a comment if you have any questions about ClickFunnels. And I'll be happy to answer it. All right, guys, peace. See you guys in the next video.